use of canes and walking sticks as weapons of personal protection is becoming more popular nowadays for many reasons. There is a perception that the world is getting a little harder and people are getting a little more desperate, so having a defensive tool at hand is something that makes people feel a little more security. There is also a perception that environments are becoming more non-permissive for those people who are willing to carry self-defense tools. And an ambulatory aid is something that anyone can carry without question. For me, I love all things martial. I love training weapons. I love the flow with weapons. And I love what weapons give to me as far as exercise, light resistance training, and focus. Now I'll tell you what, when it comes to exercise, combative exercises or combative movement keep me coming back. So I will put the time in, I will get the heart health from moving and getting my blood flowing and getting my heart rate up and I will continue to do it. This cane movement is a lot of fun for me. The close range practice of countering disarm attempts and clinching is perhaps the most important part of the cane drilling that we do. The Boondock Eskrima Cane Combatives course is something that is very simple to learn. You will be learning things like applying blunt impact force using the cane as a force multiplier against targets. You'll be hitting heavy bags and you'll be learning how to step through and strike with power. You'll learn the different ranges of using your cane, and such as long range, medium range, and close range. And you will learn how to counter people grabbing your cane and trying to take your cane away from you. We also briefly talk about use of force laws in our country because it's important to understand that if you believe that you may have to defend yourself one day. But most of the focus will be on the simple combative use of a blunt impact weapon. And the beauty of this is that it becomes very adaptable to many different situations. You have to understand how to use the weapon and then by training with it, you can become very adaptable and find various uses to the weapons. You can also adapt the principles to other weapons, shorter weapons, longer weapons. As long as you know how to move, you can adapt to whatever is in your hand. This is the beauty of being a principle-based system. Now, one thing to understand is we will keep it simple. If you don't have something to come away with from a si one single session that you can apply in reality, I have wasted your time. So I like to keep things simple and real and very, very accessible. You won't be learning how to duel against another cane. You'll be learning how to use a cane as a tool of personal protection in the worst case scenario. Thank you. Have a great day.